Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Snake Doc here, and it's that time again. Craft holsters, custom holsters for everybody. So I've already cut this package open because I was so excited when this arrived here. So what do I have inside? We have a holster for a SAR B6, black right-handed. Let's go ahead and uh, Remember my uh, discount code, Snake Doc, will get you 10% off. Uh, usually they give you a nice chamber flag like this too. It's packing material, we'll move that stuff out of the way. So uh, all caps, Snake Doc, all one word, and you get 10% off these lovely things. So what we have here, this is the Falco Kydex holster here. Falco emblems on the belt loops. Belt loops are nice. These are made for inch and a half belt here. So let's show you. There we can see an inch and a half belt going through there. Just perfectly. SAR B6 right here in front of me. This is polymer lower frame with the steel upper. We'll go ahead and uh, show that we are clear there you can see the magazine follower nothing in the chamber and we're gonna go ahead and keep it cocked and locked with the safety on and i want to show you guys how impressive this fit is listen oh it is like butter i mean look at the look at that detail you can even catch part of the outline of the trigger they just did an outstanding job on this. Now, the other thing that you'll notice, really high sweat guard on there, covers all the way past the slide and protects, you know, the hammer area. Still have clearance for a magazine release, which is nice. Um, I'm not a big fan of when the Kydex comes up over the magazine release. Um, this magazine release should not be bumped by clothing. Um, I don't believe that's going to be an issue. Um, but we'll find out, I guess. Um, really nice Kydex, though. Plenty of room for my fiber optic sight in there. You're not going to be able to see it, I guess. Oh, there you can kind of catch it. There you see it. Plenty of room for the sights. And I just love the fit. There is no adjustability on here that I can see for um, tightening up. I mean, they basically sandwiched these two layers of Kydex together and then they did their form fit around the trigger guard. So the draw is really nice and I'm holding this upside down, giving it a nice shake and nothing's falling out. But it just is so smooth and it just fits so nicely. Um, safety is on, so it doesn't affect that. Go ahead and put the safety off. Guess we can drop the hammer. We'll go double action here. And it's gonna go in just as smooth. So the it's relieved enough right here that the safety can be in either position. So if you were cocked and locked, not a problem. Or if you were in double action mode, not a problem. Or if you were decocked with the safety on. <clears throat> so I really like it. Very impressive stuff here. I like that it completely comes down and covers the muzzle and it starts to bevel, taper in just a little bit there. Um, it looks like this, this top portion of the belt loop is slotted. There you can see. So you see that slot. So it looks like you would be able to uh, lower. Would that be right? Yeah, you might be able to switch positions on that to get a... Uh, uh, you could, you know, do one up, one down for a slight cant. Um, but I'm just, I'm just, excuse me, I'm just really impressed with this. So I'm going to go ahead and put it on and we'll show you guys what the draw looks like on there. So stay tuned for that one second. Okay, so I just went ahead and threaded that uh, belt through there and I have it behind my three o'clock belt loop on these pants. So it's a nice concealable position right here. I can still get to it with the draw. The draw is really smooth. Again, that Kydex is just excellent on there. So I would be able to come up and uh, 
really do a good job with that. Um, <clears throat> I like how nice and tight it fits to the body. It doesn't feel like it's I'm losing the, the grip out away from myself at all. And um, I really think it'd be totally concealable with a, uh, you know, uh, unbuttoned shirt or a light jacket or anything like that. Um, what I would do if I was in like using this in a competition is I would probably shift it more forward so that I could be able to get it up and out of the holster a little bit faster. But for concealment purposes, this is a great position for me. This is uh, about four, yeah, it's probably about four o'clock, four thirty position, and I can still reach down and index it and find that find that grip, get my nice purchase on there with my hand, and come out with the draw and the reholstering is nice. So I'm I am extremely happy with this holster. So check them out online, www.craftholsters.com, and uh, if you put in code snake doc s n a k e d o c all one word all caps 10% off so thank you guys for watching and always shoot safe